Welcome back, everybody. In 1978, at 14 months old, Keith Edmonds became the victim of child abuse. He received third-degree burns to his face from his mother's boyfriend. We're going to talk about that. Good morning, Keith. Talk about a being uh, obviously a little bit different and kids teasing you. What was that like for you growing up? You know, it, it happened often as a, as a younger child. Mm -hmm. um, as I grew into adolescence, it kind of went away. Mm -hmm. um, it, it was hard, mm -hmm. um, but it was something that I dealt with with a smile. Mm -hmm. I never let it control me. Um, I heard it, and uh, it's just the way I handled it. It's, you know, I, I face situations head on where I'm not scared, mm -hmm. so that's kind of how I handle that. What do you tell child abuse victims? Anything specifically? Keep on fighting, persevere through it. Um, you're facing adversity, and the best thing you can do is persevere. You, uh, we didn't mention, went to Flushing High School, went to Mott Community College for a yeah. short time. Now you live in Nashville, Tennessee. What are you doing these days? I work for Dell uh, Computers, uh, doing emerging business sales for them. Mm -hmm. um, Hang out there, listen to music. And we're gonna, you're going to speak tomorrow in, in your hometown of Flushing. I am. I'm speaking at uh, City Shop Cafe, uh, 103 East Main Street, Flushing, Michigan, at 7 p.m. Mm -hmm. And uh, what is your message? What is your main message that you speak about? My message is about just persevering through any situation that you may find yourself in. Um, I do have child abuse that I persevere through. I do persevere through several other things. Um, I think everybody actually faces adversity that they have to persevere through. Mm -hmm. Losing a job, going through a divorce, what have you. So it's perseverance, and there's a lot of perseverance in that story. Child abuse is just the beginning. You're an inspiration to a lot of people, Keith. Yes, I am. And um, it sounds like a great book, and in fact, you say you're writing a book, and maybe we'll talk to you about that in our next hour. Okay. Keith Edmonds joining us this morning.